Hi, I'm Paul from shoeguide.run and this is a new Catamount trail shoe from Brooks. Okay, so the Catamount is a new trail shoe from Brooks. Um, first thing that strikes you is its dazzlingly clean white looks and the, uh, the, the team at Brooks tell us it's designed to be white to show up um, the endeavours of your, uh, or the, the uh, a result of the, uh, the, the picture of your endeavours over the trails, um, tell a bit of a story about all your various adventures. So if you're buying it, um, yeah, great looking shoes, so clear and, and bright and dazzling in fact, that I had to adjust the contrast on the, uh, on the camera. But yeah, pure white, really nice looking shoe. You can see um, the trails where I am have been pretty dry. Um, it's been really warm the last couple of days. So not too bad at all. We've got plenty of cushioning here and it's the same um, DNA flash material that was used on the Hyperion Tempo. So um, it feels a little bit different because it's a trail shoe and because of the nature of the surface where you're running. So it feels to me a little bit softer. Um, it's the nitrogen infused, so it's quite responsive as well. Again, on the trails, just feels really natural, really nice. Um, it's a six millimeter drop. Again, um, for me personally, I find that spot on. Not really too noticeable that it's any different from your regular road shoes um, or lower profile races. So a nice sweet spot, I think, for the trails. Um, traction on the outsole. It's not the grippiest shoe in the world, um, but traction is perfectly fine for myself, uh, where I run a mixture of gravel tracks, forest trails, grass, um, and even road occasionally. So a nice balanced um, tread across the sole, meaning when you're on the firm surfaces, the studs don't poke through, it's thick enough the cushioning anyway, so you're not going to notice that. But yeah, um, able to cope with most things. Um, and I think Brooks are pitching it more at the, the ultra or longer distance trail runner. Um, upper wise, really quite simple, basic, um, breathable mesh, reinforced kind of rubberized overlay rammed around the, uh, the bottom of the upper section on top of the midsole there. Um, yeah, I've got a Velcro section at the back if you want to attach gaiters. Um, gusted collar, wraps around the midfoot, really nice. For me, perfect fit. The, the build quality on books is uh, really nice. So as soon as you put them on, really nice fit. Um, a nice smooth detail to the, uh, the tongue as well. I found it a great fit straight away. So yeah, quite happily, I've been running maybe, I think my longest running these has been 12 miles um, on a mixture of surfaces. And it's been spot on, can't complain at all. It's ni um, nice, light, responsive, and enough cushioning as well on that various, uh, various terrains. Um, out 1st of August, so um, I've been training for about a week, covered about 30, 40 miles in total, but uh, really enjoyed it. And I don't think it's gonna stay white for much longer, uh, particularly as it's uh, starting to rain right now. Thanks for watching, we've kept it brief. If you like the channel, please subscribe, please like, and we're going to try and update a couple of times every week minimum with new, um, new shoe reviews here on shoeguide.run. Thank you.